welcome to Sanctuary. Today's lesson is on the power of words, how you were created. Verse 24, and God said, let there be livestock, let there be beasts, and it was so. Verse 26, and this is where I want you to pay attention. God said, let us, so now he's talking to Jesus and he's talking to the Holy Spirit. This is God the Father, the creator of all things. They're talking, and he says to all of them, he said, let us make man, and so you and I are mankind, let us make mankind, mankind in our image after our likeness. And read this. This is still verse 26. And let them have complete authority over the fish of the sea, the birds of the air, the beasts, and over all the earth, and over everything that creeps upon the earth. And verse 27. So God created man which is men and women god created man in his own image in the image and likeness of god he created him male and female he created them and then look what he does here with man and woman with men and women and god blessed them and said be fruitful multiply Fill the earth and subdue it, using all of its wealth or vast resources in the service of God and man. And have dominion, or another way of saying it is have authority over the fish over the sea, the birds of the air, over every living creature that moves upon the earth. And God said, see I have given you every seed that is on the face of the land and every tree with its seed in its fruit, and you shall have them for food. And it was so. And then the last, the last verse of the chapter says, And God saw everything he had made, and behold, it was very good. Which means you and I were made good. That's good news. We're going to get into why, why I'm saying that. That God created us good. So the pattern I want you to see is God said and it was. God called and it was. God blessed and it was. So God created us like him. To say, to call and to bless. This means we have the power to create, to call, and to bless. So yes, that is, for some people, that's quite an awakening, that actually the power of how I create my world is in my own hands, is my choice. It's in my own mouth. So just as God created the world with his words, he has created us to create our world with our words. And that's the end of the lesson. Next lesson we'll get into the tongue has power. Thank you for joining me on Sanctuary.